if there's a problem, there's nearly always a solution to be found to that problem. And I think that's what engineering and entrepreneurship is about, finding solutions and finding answers. In 1978, Stephen Grant solved his first problem by inventing a high-output, high-efficiency solid-fuel backboiler. Grant Engineering has been solving problems ever since and is now the biggest manufacturer of oil-fired boilers in both the UK and Ireland. People will always burn fossil fuels and our aim is that if they have to burn fossil fuels, they must burn it as efficiently as possible. I absolutely love the business to be hands-on. I really enjoy it. I look forward immensely going to work on a Monday morning where most people are thinking, oh, the hell, I have to go to work today, but I love it. I wake about three or four o'clock in the morning, planning and designing. I have always some new idea that I want to try out or something that I want to work on or something I need to perfect. And then when I arrive into the factory, I make some sketches. And then uh, with the research and development department and myself, we, we put it onto CAD and so on and take it to a point where it's a production prototype. It's very important to me to have products that are environmentally friendly. That's why I've diversified into solar panels, because I see it as a very green uh, issue and very good for the environment. And we're also working on the development of wood pellet boilers. It's very important to me that it's based in Borough, because that's where my family are based and that's where my roots are. And that's where I want to give employment and uh, make a success of the company. I take a walk every morning about a two-mile trek around the castle grounds. Uh, it's really beautiful. Every morning you see something different, a different bird, a different flower, a different leaf. It's magic. It gets the heart pumping and it refreshes the mind. And I find that a good fast walk and a cold shower after it and you're set up for the day. I have had an affinity here because when I worked as a mechanic in a local garage, I used to repair their lawnmowers and chainsaws and tractors and so on here. So I've been familiar with the, the castle for a number of years. To somebody with an engineering background, this place is an Aladdin's cave. This was the seat of engineering at the very start of the Industrial Revolution. All of this telescope was designed and built and every component manufactured here on this site. I would try to emulate the, the work of the great third earl and the fourth earl who invented the steam turbine and that they were very inventive people and I set my sights to be as inventive as them if I could possibly be and I think I have succeeded in that.